Hello everybody, Derek here from Addictive Tips, and in this video we're going to be talking about how to encrypt your cloud files before they go up to services like Dropbox and whatnot on Linux. So to start off, you're going to need to learn how to install Cryptometer. Now, Cryptometer is a program that I cover uh, detailed instructions on in the article below, so check that out. But once you got it installed, open it up and click the plus sign. Then you're going to need to click Create New Vault. From here, click on the Home folder and locate your sync folder. We've got Mega, we've got Nextcloud, we've got Dropbox. In this in this tutorial, we're going to do Dropbox. So to start off, <clears throat> name your vault. Uh, let's name it Test Run. Click the Save button. Now our vault is called Test Run. So if I go into Dropbox here, and we find the Dropbox folder, this is just a folder called Test Run. And uh, then I can type in a secure password. And click the Create Vault button. Now this vault is locked up and there's a master cryptometer thing here and there's a bunch of other stuff here. And uh, from here, to unlock the vault, I just type in the correct password and it's decrypted. So in the test run area, everything is inside of this folder here and inside of this file here. So if I want to put in, let's say, I'm going to upload a SQLX file, this nohop file and this clipboard file and this absentee ballot thing of mine. Put it in here and uh, it's, showing all of this stuff is now encrypted and then I can click uh, over here and I know that stuff is being encrypted so it's being uploaded and all the files that are going up to Dropbox Dropbox doesn't know what it is Dropbox sees it as weird looking files and when I'm done I just click the lock vault button close cryptometer no big deal and then I can go to uh, Dropbox here and uh, we can check out our encrypted folder in test run. It has no idea what's going on here. Dropbox doesn't know what anything is. Just obscure random files. I put these files here and I know exactly what they are, but no one else does. And uh, they can still be synced and they can still be accessed. Like if I take out my iPhone here and I open up the Dropbox app, I can still see all these files and I can install Cryptometer on my iPhone and I can check it out and everything is there. But the good thing is it's not visible to anybody but myself. And then when I go on and I want to unlock it, I just unlock it and then, oh, there is all my files, just like normal. So guys, if you are seriously concerned about cloud storage providers and their, them being able to view your files, but you still need to use their services, please check out Cryptometer. Please uh, check out our article in the description as well to learn how to install it and all of that. Till next time, this has been Derek and I will see you in the next video.